this is the lymphatic system. We will be looking at only a few of the structures of the lymphatic system, starting on this mid-sagittal model right here. So first of all, when you inhale air through your nose, um, the air is going to pass by this uh, tonsil right here. This is called the pharyngeal tonsil because it's at the uh, beginning of the pharynx. Okay, and so this is going to make sure that nothing foreign is actually able to get um, down into your lungs. At least that's the goal. The next, uh, we have uh, the palatine tonsil, which again, you take food, air, drink through your oral cavity and ultimately down through your pharynx and esophagus. Um, this here, this palatine tonsil is going to make sure that nothing um, funny uh, or suspicious gets uh, down into the rest of your body as well. Uh, and finally, the lingual tonsil. So pharyngeal, palatine, and lingual tonsil. The lingual tonsil looks a little bit different. It looks like a little bump off the back of your tongue, but that is also lymphatic tissue. All right, moving to this next model right here. Okay, so we should be familiar with this torso model. Uh, what I want to point out now is in the abdominopelvic cavity. All right, if we remove the liver and the stomach, what we see is a purple organ all the way to the left side of your abdominopelvic cavity. This is called your spleen. All right. And the last structures that I want to point out today are way down here. This is a representative sample of um, these structures and vessels which are all throughout your body. Uh, these white vessels, um, they look kind of spotty. That is representing the fact that they have one-way valves in them because these are very low pressure conduits. And essentially, uh, lymph fluid needs to be kind of milked up uh, to the heart. Okay? And so these white vessels right here are lymphatic vessels. These little green dots here represent lymph nodes. And so these are populated with uh, immune cells, so with your T and B lymphocytes, and those lymphocytes are going to patrol that fluid, that lymph that is flowing through them, essentially acting like a cotton ball type filter uh, before the lymph returns to the bloodstream. Okay, so again, this is the lymphatic system. We have the lymphatic vessels in white. We have the lymph nodes in green. We have the spleen. And if we go back to this model right here, we have one, two, and three pairs of tonsils.